Welcome to another Cosmic Scope Classics. Today we will be playing some Outrun for the Sega Mega Drive or the Sega Genesis, depending on where you're from. This is the 1991 version. There was versions before it for the Master System and stuff like that. But we'll just get on to it and see how it goes. Right, so we're pressing start. Pressing start. We're ready to go. And we're ready to go. Oh, it looks nice. Get ready. Right. As far as I'm aware, this doesn't auto go, so I have to go myself, right? And we're just kind of chilling, racing the car. And it's. If you've seen. I've done another video on a. Afterburner. An afterburner was created by. developed by the same person, Yo Suzuki. And then we did this. Well, we did this first, and then he created Afterburner. As you can probably see, the car I'm driving is quite clearly a Ferrari. It's a Ferrari Tessarossa Spider, to be precise. Very similar to the car used in the 80s in Miami Vice. So, it's just kind of a poster car for that kind of era. It was like my favourite car at the time, Ferrari Tessarossa Spider. It's just such a cool looking car, just over the top and crazy. Ooh, turn, 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 go, 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 go. So yeah, and that's why it looks, it just looks, it's just a cool looking car, really. And I've got to go fast. It's not s s Sonic, but I've still got to go fast, right, I'll go left here. I kind of had the choice to go left or right. Oh, I made it through the first stage. That was easy enough. Long to... No. Okay, I don't know what happened. We'll st try that one again. Get ready. Because I don't actually know what happened. <laughs> I, I think I was I was playing that, but I don't know what happened. It's, okay, we'll just start again. We'll, right, we'll turn left. And not or reset me. So I have got a stage timer and a lot of details and a score. I've not really been paying attention to it. I actually have no idea what happened there. I thought I was doing well and then all of a sudden I wasn't doing well. Right, so we're going about 120 mile an hour down the road, which is and it crashed. Right, let's go again. Don't crash at 120 mile an hour because that's not what will happen. It will go a lot worse for you than that, right? But yeah, this game was one of the one of the first driving games I played. At the time, it was wasn't really. I never had this console, but I remember friends having it, and we always wanted to play this. And I could have got it on the master system, which I had, but. Obviously, at that time, I wasn't the one in charge of what game. Really, I wasn't really the one in charge of what games I was getting, and I couldn't get a game all the time or as often as I can now because I really don't know what's happening. On here. Right, I think I'm. I'm I running out of time. Is that what's happening? Get ready. Do I have to do this in a certain amount of time? Is that what's happening? Because... Ah, uh, maybe it's because I'm breaking my car. Ah, uh, I think that's what it is. I think it's because I never changed the high gear. Because now I'm doing 170. Ah right, okay, I didn't realise I had to change it to higher gear. That makes sense now. Because I'm playing on the Genesis or the Mega Drive, whatever version. Ooh. I have to switch gear. And there's other controls. Because on the master system. There is only six buttons. 
was on this that I've now changed to, there was more buttons. And I didn't realise I had to change gear. made it past that stage. Right, okay. So I was playing it, I was just Checkpoint. messing it up. Oh, I, I seen the two cars in front of me, I tried to dodge them. Oh, I do have a timer. It's up in the top left, but it says time. And I can run out of time. I just didn't realise that. I didn't do very well this game at all when I first played it. But now I'm driving past. Uh, Ooh. Right, let's try that one again. Right, so like I can crash as much as I want, just as long as I can. As long as I can get back on the road fast. Ooh. Dodge the cars. As you can see, it does look very similar to other games. Well, another game I've done on my channel called Afterburner. Because it was developed by the same person. Uh, I keep, I always forget that I do have brakes as well. Like, and I can use the brakes. But, brakes always slow you down. But, uh, and... 3, 2, 1... Game over. Okay. How far did I make it? I made it... I made it better that time. I made it further. I definitely improved on the last round. Ooh, so I have to put in my name. Okay, so there's a thing. Where am I going? Cause we, this used to be a higher... This, bleh, English Cosmic. English. This used to be, look at that, Cosmic fits perfectly. So, if I continue, right. Now that we know we're to use the brakes, uh, because before, brakes just slowed you down, really. And who wants to go slow? So, sound, I'm just... <laughs> I'm playing it on normal, right. We'll just keep playing it on normal, because even if I do rubbish, we'll... I'll do rubbish. Get right. ready. Right, so that's why I was running out of time before because I was, on, I was limiting myself to 120 mile an hour. Limiting myself to 120 mile an hour. This car could had, yeah, it was no, I would never believe this car would be able to get up to 180 mile an hour. But there must be some truth in it. That's what the developer. So like, had the brakes there. Right, so if I hit oh, my push. Don't wanna hit the truck, don't wanna hit the truck. Right, so most racing games the brakes would slow you down so you can turn better. Not in this one, it seems, right? All these... I can't even tell what's going on. I'm going so fast. I am going so fast. Right, so the brakes don't actually seem to do much. Checkpoint. Ooh, checkpoint. Play extended. That's always a good sign. It's always going so fast. Ooh, that's not good. Get back on the road. Luckily, you know, because like in life, if you have a major crash and you flip your Ferrari, you can just be like, go back into it. And like, it's not an issue because you can just always just go back into your Ferrari. Okay, I thought I was past that one. The same when you spin it, you can always just go back and reset. In the words of Eminem, life's no Nintendo game. I don't know if the song, know that song, but yeah, that's what I think of when I die. Like, 
play for the Nintendo game. We just get reset. We gave okay, us a car and that way. I don't know how they break get round corners with that without not dying. Did I break? Okay, I can break before the corner. No, oh, I'm just oh, yeah. I really need practice at this game. This I've not played this. To be honest, this is nostalgic for me because I remember always wanting to play this in the arcade. Because it was like, oh it's a car racing game and it looks cool. I, I obviously it looked cool at the time, but now I'm like Ooh no, we'll just we'll just we'll just no, we'll just end it at eight. Like I could use really naughty names like to do like you do with your high school board. But because I am trying to be a good boy, a good cosmic a good cousin to it. I will not be putting those three letter names and such that yeah, that spell out bad words. Because I am a responsible adult who does adulting very well. Not adultery, adulting. Adultery is a very different thing. Oh, I changed to low, that's why I can that's why I was one myself to leave on. Twenty mile an hour. <laughs> it's funny. 120 mile an hour is a limit. I go 120 mile an hour in the car or on my motorbike and I cry. <laughs> I'm of no. I am not admitting that I would do that stuff. I'd say if I was to do that speed. I'd probably cry and panic, but I do not condone speeding of any type. This is a video game and as such, you should only speed in video games. Not do speed, just go fast. Check like, cause what kind of speed does Sonic get? Why? Why? Who are you? You're just, you're just taking up the whole road. Like, get off the road, stupid. I don't even know where they were driving. But get off the road. This is not going well for me at all this way. Maybe I should have went left again. Left seems to do better. But right, right looks nicer. Oh, back in the road. Oh no, it's cloudy. It's cloudy. That is really hurt my eyes. Right, okay, so I have to use the brakes more. Are there other Fer I, I think there are other Ferraris. The, I think they are. I wonder, like, that's the thing is, so they must have got licensing for this and back in the day because it's quite obvious that like, Ferrari badge that's on the back. The style on the back. Maybe, to me, it seems it's quite obvious it's a Ferrari style. So they must have got licensing. Switch to high gear and you do a bit of a wheel spin. Oh, game over. We did terrible again. Like, we can crash in this game and not die. I don't, I don't, I don't, I just, I just, A -A 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 -A. I am, that is my name. That is my, my name is A A A A A A A A A Yes, my name is A A A A A A Right, let's go. Right, let's do this. We're gonna get, get this. We're gonna have a higher score than we did last time. And we're gonna use the brakes more. And we're gonna do a lot of loose spin. That was nice. That's some nice smoke. We'll change to higher gear. And we'll do... We'll go a lot faster. There's not really much in the way of sound effects for the engine in this. It's just like... Just obviously the music and the tire screw. I'm so glad the games have progressed so much more. Because there's nothing quite like the sound of a classic Ferrari. Like these old Ferraris sound amazing. Obviously at the time, at the time they can't make
cars. Ooh. Ow. Yeah, I just wrecked my Ferrari. Don't want to do that. Wait. Go, 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 go. We don't want to die that thing. We want to beat a high school. We change into high gear. Do a wheel spin. Get up to 182 mile an hour, which seems to be my top speed. Go left. Because I did better when I went left last time. This is just trucks. I don't know who they are. Are they... Why? I didn't even use his indicator. And it, it looks like a, like a Volkswagen view. Which aren't that fast. Maybe a Porsche, because Porsche and Volkswagen views are the same. He came into my lane without indicating. It's no wonder I crashed into him. In all fairness, I've not been indicating either when I've been changing lanes. Which is really just not how to drive. Oops, I didn't realize that happened. was gonna happen. But saying that, <laughs> there's an old saying that's like, why would I use my indicators? It's nobody's business when I'm bored. Ooh, I'm, I've got 20. As you can see, my score goes up for every like, part I pass. So I've got to do another fair wee bit before I can beat my high score. Ooh, 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 up and down, up and down. And there's a truck here. Uh, and he's flashy. Get out of the way, get out of the way. I need to, I need to go fast. Ah, that was close, close. I don't know who designed this road. Right, so... I need to get a bit further than that before I can pass my high score. So, right, we won't bother with the, the the name, because we're going for a high score. We're going for this high score. A lot of wheel spin, that's killed our time already, we changed the high gear. There's not a higher gear we can change to, so we have to sit quite happily at 180 mile an hour. It seems like fast enough anyway to me, because I don't really want to go any faster, because you've seen how much I crash just going 108. Ooh, <laughs> I almost hit that drop. It's just not the, it's like, I don't feel bad at the drop. just happens. But, Like all that wheel spin, it looks sliding, it's like, ooh, yeah. That would probably kill me. And I'm guessing I'm... What's in that, actually? I can't tell who I am. Like, I could be the woman driving, or I could be the man driving, because it doesn't really show what side the steering wheel's on, and it doesn't show where it is. So yes, it could be in America. Checkpoint. Seems likely because of how quick the roads are. But it could be anywhere, which is good because it's like, if you want to, you can be like, oh, I'm the woman driving, or I'm the guy driving. It, I mean, it could be it could be a guy with long hair. Like the '80s, that was a thing. Miami Vice, that was a thing. So it could. Or it could be the women with short. But anyway, let's not get caught up in the logistics of this. You can basically pick who. Well, this, uh, English. You can decide who you want to be, and you can just be like, right, I'm the one driving on that side, and I'm driving on the seat. And because of you can't tell who's who, quite happily just race along quite happily. Back up to here. I have like 20 seconds. Five seconds, four seconds. Oh, we're gonna make it. No, I didn't make it. Oh, because I have to. 
Like, this game is really difficult. I am actually struggling with this game right now. I didn't realise I completely forgot how difficult that game was. For me, anyway. I'm just, like, just nowadays you rely on, well, I rely on, you probably rely on it too. It's like, the graphics and the gameplay was with that. I thought, and maybe this is why I sucked at the game when I was younger as well, and I could never even get to that point where I was, is because I was not using a brake because brakes slow you down, and I never wanted to be slowed down. I just wanted to go as fast as possible. And 182 mile an hour seemed to be as fast as we're going. Anyway. Was, I got better, but that'll do it. We will, you kind of seen that. If you want to play these kind of games, they are, you can get them pretty easily. They're readily available on the internet. If you know how to look, because trying to find copy of this game and the console would be very difficult. Anyway, that was another Cosmic Skull Classics. Outrun for the sake of Mega Drive, Genesis, I don't know, it's, there's just so many versions of this game now, I'm surprised they've not remade it. Anyway, Cosmic Skull Classics, have fun, see you later, bye.